Welcome back to study section 2 on FMW201 Introduction to Forestry and Wildlife Management of the Laotech Open and Distance Learning for Agricultural Sciences Option 200 level course materials Study section 2 Forest as a Renewable Natural Resources Introduction A forest consists of trees, shrubs, herbs, climbers, creepers and grasses in association with soil, water and air. Renewable ones are trees, shrubs, herbs, climbers, creepers and grasses. This is because they can regenerate or reproduce after harvesting them. So at the end of this study section, you should be able to you should be able to discuss the ability of forest resources in Nigeria. You should be able to explain the distribution of forest distribution resources in Nigeria. You should be able to discuss the potentials of forest resources in Nigeria. And lastly, you should be able to itemize all other non-wood produce. Let's talk about this learning of common after the order availability of forest resources in Nigeria. Nigeria land area is about 99 million hectares. Out of this, only 10% is under forest reserve. And it is sad to note that the land under forest reserve has been decreasing steadily since 1979. In Ondo State, about 107.36 kilometers square of forest in Hori have been converted to casual land. Also in Kano State, about 70 kilometers square of forest land has been cleared for a dam project, which is known as Tigaja. While in Kogi State, about 183.89 kilometers square of the forest land in Najaukuta has been used for establishment of the steel complex. So tree species and herbs have been depleted or wiped out completely as a result of indiscriminate state government policies, as well as reaction to economic, social, and political tensions from ever increasing urban population. Also, deforestation in Nigeria has been estimated 14 thousand kilometers square between 1979 and 1995 so it is probably that the current rate of deforestation will be much higher as the time goes on therefore deforestation is caused by illegal felling of the trees farming and other physical developments such as industrial and other infrastructural developments natives who have lost their lands to government set fire to forest estates as a result wildlife species are being wiped out completely due to modified or lost habitat therefore certain tree species are becoming in danger e.g iroko and maogani which have been exported for many years and were obtained from these natural forests distribution of forest resources in nigeria there are distinctive there are distinctive there are distinctive ecological zones in nigeria corresponding to the rapid rap there are distinctive ecological zones in nigeria corresponding to the rapid decline in total annual rainfall and duration of wet season from the south to the north this results in the moist tropical rainfall which includes a sizable component of fresh water and mangrove swamps in the south the rainforest is characterized by a great variety of trees which occur in several layers and abundance of climbers and herbs the trees are predominantly evergreen with with deciduous trees on the margin grasses are virtually absent in the rainforest the mangrove vegetation is commonly found in the creek near the sea while the rainforest is found mainly at Akwaibon, cross river edo and parts of ondo ogun ekiti oyo and ocean states furthermore the forest 
declines into savanna of steady dry nature as they reach into the arid zone beyond the latitude of 120 degree north. So the Sahel, Northern Guinea savanna, Southern Guinea savanna, and derived Guinea savanna are grouped under savanna region in which up layer is dominated by grass with scattered trees. So trees are usually small with twisted boles owned to frequent burning. Can you read up for more explanation on the distribution of forest resources in Nigeria in your study materials? Potentials of forest resources in Nigeria. The southern forest has the largest potential for timber production. Forest potential in the north area ranges from extensive dry land plantation development to community-based forests to prevent erosion and stabilize the fragile soil against desert encroachment. In the savanna and semi-arid areas, livelihood in most places depends on forest for food, vegetable oil, fodder, resin, and fuel wood for domestic energy. Farm residues left on the farm, that is the maize and rice stalks, after a fest are the purpose of providing shelter and fodder for livestock, as well as protect the soil from wind and water erosion. The following are the specific potentials derived from the forest. One, fuel wood. Tree provide the wood resources of the forest. About 80% of the wood produced from the forest in Nigeria is utilized as combustion fuel. Generally, wood is the main domestic fuel in developing countries. It is used in cooking meals, eat and light in the house, cure, tobacco, smoke fish, bake bread, used in industrial umbrellas, for poetry and other craft works, timber resources. About 80% of the wood extracted from the forest in the developed countries are usually industrialized. Wood in the basis of the raw materials for about 10 wood-based industries identified by the raw materials. The industries include sawmills, plywood, and particle board, poles, match toothpick, furniture, fender, pencil and ruler, flush door, and the pump and paper industry. Pump wood production. This is the one of the potentials derived from the forest. Nigeria has three functional pump wood based industries in Nigeria and it includes Nigerian paper mill Cheba, new sprints manufacturing company at Akwaibon and European paper mill in Nogu State. The following are known wood products obtained from forests. First one is fruits. Species used include pear fruits. Species used include pear delicious, eludis, African breadfruits, African star apple, and etc. The second one is tani. Tani is being extracted from Acacia species and it is being used in leather industries. Why tiny extracted from the bark of mangrove trees are used as a substitute in phenotype adhesive gum. This is produced by a shrubby plant, Acacia seniga, Acacia albinda, which occur in Sahel and Sudan vegetation region of the country. Gum is an important export item in Nigeria as Nigeria supply 10% of the world demand. Dye. Extracts from the old shrub of Lako Kapos is used for dyeing clothes. For example, the Adie and Kado. Fats. Shea butter is being the most popular and it is an export produce. Nigeria produces about 10% of the world demand. Medicine. Our medicinal stock are abundant everywhere in the country. 
Arms also produce fruit for food, medicine, and wrapping leaves. More important arms are protein sweetness, which include miracle berry and kaftan. White light is an important source of source of protein in Nigeria, constituting about 20% of the mean annual consumption of protein in the southern part of the country. White light and freshwater fisheries can be developed with little capital to boost protein production within a short period of time. Management of wildlife has been in game reserves and it is relatively recent. Nigeria has several national parks, which include the Lake Chad, Cross River, Old Oyo, and etc. In addition to several green reserves located in various parts of the country. I hope you've learned one of two things from this video section. I enjoy you to read more in your study material for deep understanding of what we've been talking about since. Thank you for listening.